Thank you, Elise and uh, Mr. Whip, Mr. Speaker. Thank you for your leadership uh, and uh, leader. Thank you very much. Uh, today, this is going to be a great week. Uh, we have the National Small Business Week ahead of us, and I will tell you, small business makes up makes up the backbone of this country. Seventy-five percent of the workforce, seventy-five percent of the payroll is generated by small business. We're going to be highlighting small business this week uh, and talk about the jobs it creates and talk about the role the private sector plays in, frankly, saving our country. Small business is in every industry, and it's in every community. So tomorrow we're going to have an HVC 201 from 3 o'clock to 4.30, 14 businesses uh, from across the country coming to the Capitol to show what they do and how they do it and maybe talk about the great things that are happening to them and some of the regulations that are choking them to death. We're going to have bakers. We're going to have distillers. We're going to have... Uh, Ammo manufacturers are all going to be displaying their products and talk about the challenges they're facing. And I would tell you, there are plenty of challenges from this administration. Uh, since Joe Biden has gotten in office, there's been $1.3 trillion of regulations put on Main Street America. $1.3 trillion. And in a time it's hard to hire people right now, it's, it's meaning that we've got, we got to spend 200 million man hours to offset the $1.3 trillion that the government and the Biden administration has put on small business. So we'll, we're going to talk about that. But the goal of our committee, we actually have a bipartisan committee doing great things together, but our goal is to be a voice for Main Street, be a bipartisan committee, be pro-business, have pro-business policies, cut regulations and lower taxes. Cutting regulations puts more money in the hands of the, uh, the business to give service to the customer who at the end is who we want to help. And uh, we've got to lower taxes. We've got to make sure that uh, taxes stay low because lower taxes mean more cash flow to the business. So we've got a lot of things happening. We want you all to come by and see it. But it's a great time in America to honor small business, the backbone of this great country. And with that in mind, and uh, it's an honor to, do, to deliver uh, Congressman Western, my dear friend from Arkansas.